you have any, you, you expressed how much money has been put into campaigns through these super PACs since Citizens United, and how the $7 billion figure, I think might have been George mentioned, is distinguished from the $600, $700 million figure, whatever, in the previous 20 years. Is there any data you have to show if that has affected Americans' belief that, that, that their government is not responsible to them? Um, in my written testimony, I have extensive information, um, and, and the polling on this is really overwhelming about Americans' deep concern with corruption, um, asked by uh, one pollster to rate 22 different attributes of American life. The campaign spending system comes in last. Only 20% of people are satisfied in that poll with the current campaign system. That actually is a pretty high number compared to other pollsters. Um, the New York Times found that affected with near uni unanimity, their quote, Americans want to replace the current finance system. The only dispute among Americans they found was whether they believe that the current system needs fundamental change or should be completely rebuilt. It's hard to know which one is the more fundamental thing they're trying to, to get at. Um, but we also see very deep concerns about corruption generally and dissatisfaction with American government and really, I think, and fear calls into question whether people believe in whether the government works for them. They're not wrong in being skeptical about that. Let me it, ask you, if we've only got a little time left. You said yes, there are 25 top individuals. Can you give me the top 10 names? Um, well, two of the, the, the two top names uh, now are Sheldon Adelson and Michael Bloomberg. Top 10, I can't give you off the top of my head. Thank you.